What's up? Welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Esperanza. I am a full-time content creator and I live in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. In addition to being a full-time content creator, I also have a boho home decor shop, which is Urban Darling Shop, where I sell some of my best thrifted boho home decor finds. So today's video is a thrift haul of all the pieces that I picked up on my last thrift trip. If you guys missed that video, I will leave a link to it so that you guys can watch it. So on this thrift trip, I ended up going to three different Goodwills. I didn't find anything at the first one. At the second one, I found a ton of really cute stuff and then I found one thing at the third one. I did go on a Sunday hoping that I could take advantage of Goodwill sales. They usually have like a 50% off sale on Sundays. But the problem with that is that there's always a ton of people there on the weekend as well. So things can get snatched up pretty easily. But I did find a good amount of cute things. So let's go ahead and get started with the haul of the items that I picked up at the second Goodwill. So the first thing that I picked up is this ceramic spoon. I don't usually pick up items like this just because I've had ceramics break in the past. And so they kind of like scare me to ship, but this is pretty small. And I think I have like packaging and boxes that would work for items this small. So I figured I would go ahead and try to start stocking some ceramics again. But this is basically just like this really pretty um, spoon with a flower and butterfly design on it. This part of the spoon has like this really cool like ceramic look and then it has um, like a gray tone to it on the handle part of it. I think this spoon is mainly decorative. Like I don't think that you would really use it to scoop anything up with. If anything, it's like more one of those pieces that you put on your oven or to the side, and then you could like place like stuff that you're mixing and stirring on it, like stirring spoons, things like that on it so they don't get anything dirty. I think that's what this is meant to be used for. But I thought this was a very cute vintage find. So this will be going up in my shop. The next thing that I picked up is this little ceramic dish here. It was only 99 cents, so definitely a really good deal. And I love that it has like the terracotta on the bottom, but then the top half is kind of like this really pretty rusty, chocolatey brown color. So I actually picked this up for myself because I've really been needing some like little dipping dishes and this would look super cute on my open shelves. I've been trying to collect more ceramic pieces that I can use for my shelves but also that are like functional for um, kitchen and like dining dinnerware stuff. So pick this up for myself. The next thing I picked up is for my shop and it's this little ceramic serving bowl. Um, it's not like a teapot but it's like something that I think you'd put like creamer in and um, gravy, stuff like that to like pour it out with a little spout. But I don't know what this is called. So if you guys know like what the name of these are, please let me know. I know that it's not like a teapot. I just don't know like what the name of it would be. But basically it's for um, serving creamer, gravy, things like that. But I thought this was super cute and I actually felt like it kind of complemented this piece here. They both have like these pretty floral patterns on it. I'll try to show this to you guys like a little bit better, but basically it just has like flowers, butterflies, just like the other piece. And it's just kind of like a whimsical style vintage piece, just like the um, other spoon. Are these called ladles? I feel like they're called ladles. I know that I sometimes don't know the names of all these items or exactly what they're used for. And I love that so many of you guys comment and let me know what the items are or what the names are if I happen to mess up. And I've gotten some hate for it in the past, but just so you guys know, I'm not like a professional. This isn't my full-time job or anything. It's just a passion. I just love like vintage boho pieces. And I like to collect them and sell them in my shop, but I'm not like an expert and I don't have endless amounts of time to do research because I do have a full-time job. But I just thought this was a very cute, whimsical piece and this will be going up in my shop as well. Next, I picked up this set of three wicker bowls and they were 99 cents for all three of them. It was kind of a bummer because 
even though yellow tags were supposed to be um, half off, I didn't get like the half off discount for this. Actually, I think this Goodwill, they were doing all yellow tags for 99 cents, but this was already 99 cents. So they didn't give me like any further discounts, which was kind of bummer, but I mean, whatever, it was only a dollar for the three of them. But I thought this was a very cute little set. I'm gonna have to decide if I wanna sell them individually or if I wanna sell the set of three. But these little dishes are perfect for putting like jewelry in. You could put soaps in them to like display in the bathroom. They're great as shelf decor. You could also put like keys in them. So obviously there's so many things that you could do with these. So these will be going up in my shop. Okay, so this next item is very unique. At first when I saw it, I thought it was broken. I think I might've even said that in like my thrift vlog, but I realized that this piece is actually so like do you see how this shifts around and then this piece actually comes up like that and then okay i don't want to break this but basically i think this props up straight there we go like that so it's like this really pretty sun with like carved wood flowers inside um this whole handle is like carved wood here as well it's just like a very very pretty carved wood piece which whenever i find these i always pick them up because i feel like they're so unique and they're obviously hard to find these days like they don't sell this kind of stuff in stores obviously so i'm not exactly sure what this is for i'm assuming that this is like some kind of a storage bowl like maybe that you would display stuff in it not 100 percent positive so if any of you guys know exactly what this is please comment down below and let me know. But once I do figure that out, I will be listing this in my shop. It's seriously so cool though, and even just laid flat, it's a very interesting piece. Okay, so the next thing I picked up is this little fan here. I love picking up fans like these whenever I see them, which isn't super often, but every now and then I've gotten lucky and found these. But I like to pick them up because I feel like they are perfect for basketballs. You can also just like use them as shelf decor. They're very, very cute, very bohemian. And I might list this in my shop, but at the same time, I think I might keep it for myself because I think that this would look really cute in my bathroom, which I'm still working on decorating. I'm almost done decorating my bathroom. I just need a few more things. And then once I do, I'm going to be doing like a bathroom, decorated bathroom like tour probably, or I might just wait until my apartment's 100% done, but um, we'll see. So anyway, got a little sidetracked. Back to the haul. Um, this item I will probably keep, we'll see. The last and only thing that I picked up from the third Goodwill is this little wood stand here, which I'm pretty sure is a cake stand. Like I think you'd put a cake inside or like a pie or something, or um, maybe some other kind of desserts. The only thing with that is that you must have to like lay some kind of like wax paper or something inside, otherwise the wood would get super dirty. But I feel like, I mean, this must be a cake stand. Not 100% positive, of course, so if I am wrong about that, please correct me. But um, I thought this was just like a very cute piece. This would look really pretty on like some open shelves or just on a counter. And obviously, like I said, to display um, like cakes or pies would be super cute. And then this lid goes on and keeps it fresh, I'm assuming. So I thought this was a great piece. It's in very good condition. I don't see like a ton of dings or scrapes or anything like that. The lid's in great condition. It has like a felt piece on the bottom of the stand and is very, very sturdy. So this would be a great piece. And this will be going up in my shop as well. All the pieces that I mentioned will be going up on this week's drop, which I always do my drops on Fridays unless I get busy and then I'll post them on the weekends. But I believe this video is going up on a Thursday and the haul will be going up on my Instagram at Darling Shop on Friday. 
Okay guys, so those are all the pieces that I picked up in this week's thrift trip. I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. And if you guys aren't subscribed to my channel already, please consider subscribing for more thrifting and styling videos. Also be sure to follow along on my Instagram at The Urban Darling. I post a lot of thrift content on there as well, and especially on my TikTok, which is also at The Urban Darling. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.